Tell me when. Are we live? How many viewers? All right, welcome to the Riverside uh, Senior Night. Tonight we are acknowledging six seniors, uh, three for each team. So before we begin a slideshow, I'd like to call up Rianne, Bahar, and Ava from Heritage. I know the whole school is very highly motivated. And then, of course, we got Olivia, Ray, and Avery. They can come up as well. We're going to do a good photo right here. Thank you. 
She's a key component to our grade five jamboree, and we will certainly miss her, all of her energy and leadership in those areas. Ray Waycroft. Uh, I met Ray in, at Kilmer Elementary when Ray was in just grade four. I'm not sure that Ray has grown since then because she stuck out big time then, and she was this enthusiastic girl who went after every loose ball, was really tough, and Ray is still doing that to this day. Ray was inspired last year in our provincial championship run and inspired in the final, and she is great with her enthusiasm, her work ethic, and is just a joy to coach. Ray, and I gotta get this right, is gonna move on and play in Sejan in Quebec. And that might be news for some of you, but we're really excited about that news. Uh, playing for Slam uh, basketball, and it will be uh, a great opportunity for her. So we're looking forward to that. Uh, Avery Sussex, what can I say? Uh, like I said before, I, I met Avery uh, when she, was, she came up to the J Bob program, also played club basketball with me, and Again, in grade nine, or she was part of that grade eight championship at Pitt River, that all three of them um, play at Pitt River. Um, but, and then in grade nine, we didn't have a season because of COVID. Avery, then in grade 10, burst onto the scene, and in her very first game, she scored 36 points, and uh, she hasn't slowed down uh, since. Uh, Avery's been a dominant high school player in the province. She's off to Cal Davis next year. We're super excited about that, what happens in day one. She's got a ju uh, junior national trial coming <laughs> later this summer, and hopefully she's still got some business to do with here at Riverside. One thing I will share with you is that one time I, in one of the many times I drove in and uh, Avery arrived, one day she looked over at me and she said, hey, hey Paul, do you think you'll ever tell stories about Avery Sussex like you do about Shea Sanchez and Christina Collins and Courtney Curry like that? And I assured Avery at the time that I'll probably have a couple of stories about, about Avery Sussex. Anyway, thanks for all coming tonight. We really enjoyed it. Uh, you all showing up. Um, have a good night. Okay, so we can have uh, Ray come up here, please. Come on, you guys uh, five minute warm up and we'll get going here. 